Welcome back. Welcome back to another episode of the Psych Expansion Podcast. I am your host, Gabriel Elijah, better known as GB. Some people call me Gabe, but nevertheless, I am your host. And this is another episode of the greatest podcast ever. You feel me? How y'all doing today? What's good? I know it's been a little bit since I've been here. I know. Chill on me, though. You feel what I'm saying? Because, like, sometimes life get the life in. And you just have to take a step back for a little bit and get some structure going on. So, please forgive me for being a human. You know what I'm saying? I know y'all are perfect out there. I know it. I know I got the absolutely uh, most perfect listeners. And I appreciate y'all for listening. No cap. Thank you. Um, But, yeah. Welcome back, y'all. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah what's been going on though you know last time i talked to y'all i told y'all i was coding coding is still going well still taking it day by day uh lesson by lesson module by module and i uh, hopefully i should be done i should be done i will be done it's not even should i'm not even gonna say should because like that's gonna nah i will be done december in december if i keep at the pace that i'm going I will be done in December. Um, I'm still working for Amazon. You know what I'm saying? Getting y'all y'all packages on time. If it's not there on time, it wasn't in my van. I'm just letting you know. If it wasn't there on the time, it was not in my van because I do my job the best. I do my job better than the best. You feel what I'm saying? So, yeah. I'm still working at Amazon, taking that day by day. Things was kind of slowing up for a minute. You know, and I was kind of getting eerie or weary. Like, hold on, what's going on? But basically, it was just some confusion in the office. And, you know, everything's back together now. Um, busy season's about to pick up. So I'm probably going to pick up, be having to pick up more days, do more hours. I don't know what that looks like for uh, my hobbies and things that I want to make my career. You know, part of my career. Um, yeah. Coding the Amazon is still going well. I got some surprise news that I can't tell y'all about. Probably I won't even be able to. I don't even know why I brought it up, but I probably won't be able to even tell y'all about it in this episode, right? Because it's still too new. The situation is still too new. But basically, I think that uh, love is in the air. Let's just say that I. And I may be I may be stretching by saying love, you feel me? Because again, it's still new. But but just know. News coming soon. Um today I wanna get into being intentional. Being intentional. You know I know Sometimes we make decisions, we make choices, and it could just be like, I'm going to just do this, right? I'm going to just give it a shot. But you don't have no, I don't want to say end goal, but like, you're not doing it for a reason. You're just doing it just because. And then you start to find all these things wrong with it. And the one thing that I'm really speaking on, really, really getting at is going to church, all right? And I know that's a touchy, touchy uh, subject, topic, but it's like, why does every time or a lot of the time that church is brought up, people bring up congressional judgment, all right? like i don't want to go to church i know there's like probably a lot of things that y'all maybe like dislike about the church or whatever nothing's perfect and people have their reasons for not liking things but the one i'm talking about today is going to church and congressional judgment it's like you go to church and you find out somebody's maybe says something about you to someone else in the church or you even think you know 
that they're talking about you. You may not even have proof that they are speaking on your name, but you feel judged. And I can understand why that would make you feel some type of way, right? If you're going to church to make friends, if you're going to church to impress people, if you're going to church to, I don't know, be the best dressed, I can see why, you know, that judgment from the congregation could, could bother you. What, but, but, but for me, right, I never, I don't, I don't understand it because when I think of church and like saying I, I want to go to church, I'm going there to hear the word. I'm going there to, you know, strengthen my relationship with God. I'm going for reasons outside of people's opinions. You know what I'm saying? It's like, it's like, I don't even have time for it. I don't even, I'm, I got other things on my mind. I'm not worried about what you're saying about me. And it's not like I'm being arrogant or some shit like that. Like I do care somewhat of what people think of me. Right. But if I'm doing something to better my life and you're still trying to I don't know tear me down or 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 nitpick at what I've done in my past or what I currently do and I know that within myself I know that I'm working on it like I'm not really worried about what you got to say to me right now because you know you don't know me you don't know me and it is what it is because the same way that you're judging me for doing something, like look at what you're doing. You're inside of a church gossiping about another person trying to strengthen their relationship with God. Somebody that's trying to learn about the word. I don't have time for that. That's childish. That's that's. I won't even say it's childish, right? I don't even children. I don't even know if children do that. That's just, yeah, it is what it is. That's what it is. You feel me? But yeah, judgment. I say be intentional about why you do things. Like do it for a reason. Go into it for a reason. If you go, to, if you're going to church, if you decide you want to go to church and go there because, like, I'm not telling you why to go there, but like, it would be a good. I would suggest that you go there, knowing that you are going there to do those things build your relationship with god and you know fellowship with those who who care about uh who care about what you're there for you're learning a word that way you won't even pay so much attention to those other people and another thing is don't be mad at those people for judging you don't fight fire with fire don't like start talking about them too because that don't put that puts you in the same boat as them it doesn't make it a better place it doesn't but what is that going to do for you, right? If anything, it's going to make you not want to show up. And who the fuck wants to beef in church? Like, what is that even all about? Like, you have a grudges and whatnot with people in church, like, that that was built inside of the church? Nah, 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 nah that's wild, that's wild. I'm not even going to lie, that is wild. Get a life, get a hobby, get a, get, get something. Get something. It's given... Is given bitterness. Is given unhappiness. Is given. Yeah. See, look at me being judgmental. But yeah. Don't worry about people judging you. It is what it is at the end of the day. One thing that I learned though, people gonna talk regardless. No matter what you do, no matter what you do, people are always going to talk. And like you can't stop nobody from talking you can't it is what it is let them let them say what they gotta say be confident in who you are right and if they say something and don't be so arrogant to the point where you're like you don't want nobody to say anything to you you know like if it's a family member a friend like don't just think they're saying it to 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 hurt your feelings sometimes people do say things i would hope that you've built relationship with people as far as friends that tell you things to that that they're concerned about 
or feel like you can do you know better with so whenever they tell you things don't be so like ah whatever they just they don't know they talk oh you know and if they don't know why you doing what you're doing explain to them that's your friend communicate with them let them know what you're going through and why you thinking the way that you thought or you know i think people get too caught up in like they get too caught up in thinking they live a perfect life they'll be quick to say i know i'm not perfect but then when somebody goes to give them some constructive criticism it's like the worst thing ever and i don't really too much understand that well i think i do but i guess there's like probably some nuances that goes within it all right Humans, people, friends, family, we got to do better. We got to do better. Again, don't fight fire with fire. Don't go and start talking about people just because they talking about you. That shit makes no sense. That shit really makes no sense. Not everyone's opinion is valid about you. They don't know you, you know? Again, people always going to talk. They always going to have something to say. Like, even when it comes down to you doing something with good intent, you could be like having a food banquet. Or not a banquet, but a food drive. Doing a food drive. People going to say you don't, you didn't bring enough food. Or yet you don't know how to cook. Or, or, or whatever. Like, they always got something to say. People always got something to say. And I'm just sitting here thinking about it in my head, which is making me repeat that shit. Is because like y'all feed into it so much. Whenever you know what's gonna happen, and you can sit here and agree with me and say the same thing back to me, but you'll still get mad at what you know is coming. You know what I'm saying? The thing that'll make you change, make a lot of people change their mind is like, let's just say you started a business. People are talking about your business, but let's just say your business making money. What you going to say? People are people always going to have something to say. So just like in church, you know what I'm saying? You go to church, you get, get the message, get the, get the uh, word or whatever that you need to get and let the people talk. Don't let that turn you away from becoming a better person and getting closer to God. And this episode isn't solely about God, but best believe I will never shy away from talking about God in my podcast, though. You know what I'm saying? Because none of this is possible without him. And for y'all who don't like, you know, agree with me, I'm not saying you got to go nowhere. But like, you know, this this is going to be a part of my show. If you didn't already know. But yeah, don't feed into that energy so much, y'all. Don't feed into that. That thing. People say things to get a reaction right they say things they get a reaction they want to see what you're going to say or they want to turn people against you or they want to just be liked and that's crazy though right whenever you can agree like you can talk about a person with another person just that build a relationship with that person that who, who is talking about the other as i'm telling you i really don't understand people sometimes like what what is causing you to be this way what have you done through so many years of your life to where you've neglected the fact that you are this way and you don't want to deal with it i have such trouble like understanding that and putting pieces together to even come up with a valid uh scenario where that you know i just can't think of it maybe like you grew up in maybe that's the environment that you grew up in all your life and you just haven't accepted that's part of you because you have to accept it to be able to fix it right at least i believe so i guess i somewhat believe so you have to be able 
you have to accept that is you to be able to fix it. Because if you just deny it the whole time, you're not going to see a problem. You're just going to be like, uh, I, ain't, I ain't dealing with that. That ain't me. And I know a lot of people like that. They just see that. I mean, and I'm like that in some ways too. Best believe when I talk on this podcast, I'm not always talking about other people. I may say you, I may say y'all, but whatever. I'm, I could be speaking in third person, right? It's easier for me to put it that way. I guess I can't deal with the harshness of always saying I'm like this. I'm like this. And so, cause sometimes it's really not just all about me on here. I am talking about some of y'all, you know what I'm saying? Nobody directly, but if the shoe fits, wear it, you know, if any of y'all ever want to talk, on the podcast and let me know if you have like reasons why you're like this or why what's made you like this like let me know i got you you can hit me up on instagram at ask gabriel underscore you can dm me on there you can dm me on twitter which is the same thing x.com same thing uh my facebook is gabriel elijah um you can email me email the podcast at psych expansion podcast at gmail.com you know what i'm saying stop letting people get in your head be confident in you be confident in yourself move intentionally yeah but yeah that's all i want to say today i ain't really had like too much just to give you a thought something to something to carry with you through this week be intentional don't worry about the judgment from others because people are always going to talk they always going to have something to say i promise you i promise you but don't be mad at them you know if anything try to figure out why they think the way they think because at the end of the day, your reality may not be actuality. You could be the wrong one. You may need to hear a different perspective. You feel me? Yeah, hey, yeah. You may need to hear something else. Again, right now what I'm saying may not be actuality. It could just be my reality. But you know, that's why I love to hear back from y'all. And let me know what y'all think. Tight shit. Oh yeah. I'm going to tell y'all some other news, though, real quick, real quick. Before I get out of here, I have, uh, well, me and one of my other friends are working on a podcast, a different type of podcast, where we're, like, more or less going through, I don't know, current events. And uh, current events within our lives, social media, and just all different types of things, right? It's less... uh deep conversations like this i guess i mean i guess those conversations are going to get deep but it's 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 a whole different vibe than what i do in here you know what i'm saying so be on the lookout for that i'll keep y'all updated with that and um yeah big news on the way y'all big news on the way i'll let y'all know probably like later on this week i'll probably do another episode just talking about what it is that I wanted to tell y'all today, but I can't really talk about it because I'm working with a time limit. So, yeah. Another episode maybe this week. If not, thank y'all for tuning in. Perfect people, beautiful people, wonderful people, God-fearing people. I appreciate all of y'all for tapping in. For whomever tapped in, please share this with a friend. Um, let me know what you think. And yeah. I'm back, y'all. But right now I'm actually leaving, but I'm back. I'm gonna holler at y'all.